Hello everyone, my name is Ian Lamont. I'm the author of Excel Basics in 30 Minutes, which you can download or buy via in30minutes.com. And today I'm going to be talking about how to convert a Google Drive spreadsheet, which is which uses the program Google Sheets, into a Microsoft Excel document. And this is a pretty common scenario if you want to, if you have something in Google Sheets and you've been working on it, maybe collaborating it, and then you just want to export it to Microsoft Excel so you can email it to other people or share it with people at your office who don't use Google Sheets. And this is how you do it. So here we have a, a Google Sheets document. This is a spreadsheet. Uh, as you know from reading my book, it's very similar to Microsoft Excel. It has 90% of the functionality. And this is a pretty basic thing where we're taking, um, you know, we have a bunch of uh, text entries, cells here. We have some numbers here to record the uh, identity of the, of, the, of the item. We have some figures and royalties. And then I've done, even, done some things like doing some very simple sums. So pretty straightforward uh, spreadsheet in Google Drive. And we want to convert it to Microsoft Excel. Here's how. Go to File, Download As, Microsoft Excel. So it will, it, will, it will take place pretty quickly, and then we can take a look at it. So let's open it up. And here we have it. So let me just bring it up so it's bigger. Oops. You can see that it's pretty much the same. Um, in fact, I can't even detect any difference in what the, uh, between the Google Sheets and the Microsoft Excel version. You'll notice that in the Google Sheets version, I had some hidden cells here. There's a, a hidden columns here. And Microsoft, it's preserved when it's converted to Microsoft Excel. Um, all the sums and the formulas, that's all preserved as well. The formatting looks basically the same. Uh, however, in some cases, your formatting won't be preserved. And I'm going to give you an example of that right now. So let's go back to Google Sheets, Google Drive. And here we have another Google Sheets spreadsheet. This one's a bit more complicated. So. Um, in addition to having uh, some here, we've, we've summed up some percentages. Uh, there's also a interesting looking chart here. And I used, I used one of the, uh, one of the different, one of the formats they have for, sh for charts in Google Sheets. Looks pretty cool. Just, it's basically taking this data up here and presenting it as a, uh, like a donut. So let's see what happens when we convert that to Microsoft Excel. Same process, download as Microsoft Excel. And you'll see it pop up here open it up let's see what happens converting it and we have a problem so it got the chart it got the numbers but it didn't format them properly there's a couple big problems here the first one is is that on the Google Sheets version this is percentages in the Microsoft Excel version that it converted it to it didn't preserve the it didn't preserve the number format. It just this is just presented as an ordinary number, not a not a percentage. Uh, it also didn't preserve the number of uh, decimal places. Although that's understandable because thirty three point three three percent is the same as point three 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 three. But the other big problem is this chart. So this chart looks pretty good in Google Sheets, but look at it in Excel. The number labels the the labels are missing. It got the colors basically right. It got this text okay. Um, but the numbers are gone, so you'd have to redo that. So, you know, of course, it's not a big deal to redo that, but if you have a complicated spreadsheet and you bring it into, uh, and you export it from Google Drive into Microsoft, then you have to do a bunch of formatting again. That, that's kind of a pain in the neck. So there are some drawbacks when heavy-duty charts or certain types of number formats are converted from Google Drive to Microsoft Excel. Uh, but for basic stuff, for this type of thing, just numbers and text formatting, most of that will be preserved. So those are the ins and outs of using uh, Microsoft Excel and Google Drive and converting back and forth. If you look at the if you look if you look at the in30minutes.com and go to the Excel Basics website, you'll see that I have another version, another video that talks about how to convert from Microsoft Excel to Google Drive, and that's a bit that's a bit smoother compared to the other way around. But interesting topic. My book talks about lots of different tips and tricks and how to deal with some of these issues. You can download or buy it from in30minutes.com. So anyways, lots of free videos and information on the website. And I hope if you have any questions, you can either ask it on the website or shoot me an email. All the information's in the book. Hope to hear from you soon. Thanks.